Hallelujah. God is good. He's good all the time. Amen. If you turn a Bible to the book of Isaiah, chapter 25, verses 1, it reads, O Lord, you are my God. I will exalt you. I will praise your name. For you have done wonderful things, plans formed of all faithful and sure. Wow, amazing. This is what Isaiah is doing. He's praising God. He's exalting God. Because if you read in chapter 24 of Isaiah, God is speaking about the difficult times that is going to come, a tribulation period. And in such a difficult situation, Isaiah is choosing to praise God. He's choosing to exalt God for the wonderful things that he has done in his life. You know, there is so much to thank God in our life. Yes, so much. You know, I want to tell you, maybe right now you're saying, oh, there is nothing much. You know, God has saved my life. But what is it? There's nothing much good. I want to tell you, if you're breathing, if you're alive, that means God's purpose has not yet been fulfilled in your life. And if it has not been fulfilled, he's going to fulfill it. Because when God begins something, he completes it. He's a perfect God. He's a good finisher. You know, I want you all, you know, all of us is to thank God. You know, we need to just look harder. And you know what? Thanking God is not for a day, but it's a lifestyle. You know, we, we, we don't say that, you know, I don't feel like thanking God. I don't feel like worshiping God. But Isaiah here is making a decision. He says, I will exalt you. I will praise you. You know, to praise God, to thank him is a decision. It's not based on your feelings because our feelings keep changing. But when you make a decision to praise God, is that what God honors. We need to make a decision to praise God. And why should we praise God? Because He is faithful. He has always been faithful. How many of you can say that God has been faithful? We have tasted and seen that God is faithful. You know, I want to encourage all the viewers at this time is thank God, exalt Him, lift His name high because there is so much God has done in our life so much. You know, maybe there are certain things that God has not yet done, but rest assured that he's still working on it. And in his time, you will see it come to pass. But in the meantime, let us thank and praise God. Like Isaiah said here, I will exalt him. I will praise his name because he's faithful, because he has done wonderful things in my life. Amen. God bless you.